Hey guys, um, it's time to talk about stickers, finally. We're going to talk about sticker organization. I got another one off the side here. Um, also, I'm like wearing the rattiest sweatshirt ever, but it's comfy. And um, I still sound pretty nasally, but I do feel better. It's just been, it was kind of weird and warm and chilly here at the same time. Anyway, so don't mind my ratty sweatshirt. I was going for comfort today. Um. I am, I'm going to set that one aside for right now, and I'm going to set this one aside as well. These are my main two sticker books that I have kind of moved over to. This is the main one, and you can see that it is, it is, it is bulgy, for lack of a better word. It's stuffed. Um, if you've seen many of my past videos, you know that I was using a little, a teeny, a business card holder for my um I think I have one in here for my little sheets of stickers and they're all kind of the, the the if they're not moved into here unstickered they're in here um and then I was also using this monster which is still has stickers in um it still has a pocket I need to go through that pocket I don't even know what's in there at this point it still has some coffee monster co it still has um, some Miss Moss, but I have, you can see it's, it's, it's dwindling. Some of my Benevas are in here. Um, and then randoms and then mine, there's still some of mine in here. Um, I've, I've started to pull some out, but I mean, actually quite a few. So I'm, I'm emptying this, but to move them all again seemed weird. So like, I'm trying to, I'm trying to use this when it's in the thing. This, I think I love this. It is an Oxford A5 that the rings. So the, since the rings pop through, it's really slim. I think I want to use this as a recipe book. I'm not 100% sure, but I think I want to use it as a recipe book. So anyway, I'm not coming back to that. Let's talk about this. I feel like I need to wipe that down or something. I was looking for, I thought I had a Coffee Monster Co. sticker that said I love stickers and I couldn't find it. So maybe it's stuck somewhere. <laughs> anyway, otherwise I'm going to have to do a cute little sticker for this. Um, I want to talk about how I'm using this, how I'm planning. So I went, these are actually um, Filofax tabs. They're their confetti tabs. I thought they were really cute. Um, Tyrion, buy stickers. Um, the Coffee Monster Co. Beneva. This is Sweet Freckled Designs. Is that right? Yes. Um, Miss Moss, a combo in this tab, um, Shine Sticker Studio, and then other. So one of my girlfriends um, has gotten out of planning. Her toddler got her out of planning. She's looking out of time. As organized as I need my life, I don't have time for all the stickers. So, I, And I get that. I totally get that. So she gave me a ton of Coffee Monster Co. So I've put a lot of those in here. And then she had a little bit of everything else. So it's funny because... Beneva, Amy Blonde, um, Haley, who gave me stickers, Redheaded. So I have, um, do I have? Miss Moss is where it's more. There's more in there of, of Redheads. And I was like, I mean, I, I'm Strawberry Blonde and I've, I've been red, so whatever. I will use them because a lot of them are the same stickers I've had. Oh, that's cute. I could use that one tonight. Anyway, so just to give you a little flip through here, like some Shine sticker. And then the other ones. And I put, like, I would cut this out. Let me go back to Coffee Monster Co. Fox and Pip. Starfish and Frog. It's funny, we both had Starfish and Frog. Um, a Redhead, again. Doesn't matter to me. I'm going to use the stickers. It's funny, because she gave them to me as a Christmas gift. Because she's like, I know you won't take them otherwise. And I was like, I still need to pay you. And she was like, absolutely not. I just want you to use them. Really sweet. So mine are it's just a big a hot mess as the rest of it. Um, I put mine in by company, by business, because I tend to know what I have from business. Coffee Monster Co. might be the biggest mystery right now because of Haley giving me so many. However, I stuck them all in here. And it's funny, emoji heads. And I started doing this because I was like, what if I really like these and I have no idea what they are? <laughs> so 
So I kind of, not all of them have it, hormonal headache and migraine ones, um, fatigue, like, so this was, I thought that was a great idea. So if you're using a sticker book, it's, it's really easy. It's just scissors. I just, I, it took me a minute. And basically what I have been doing over the last two, three months, well, three months, because she, it was probably a little, it was probably January when she came to me. Um, we were terrible at Christmas. Like ugh, we were never in the office at the same time. And then when we were, we weren't seeing each other. It was a mess. Anyway, um, in the evening, um, if I was caught up in the shop and chilling out, watching TV, I would take a few sticker sheets and put them in here. So that is how I filled it. So I don't have free time, but I did this and I really like it. Now, let me explain the rest of it. So this I got off of Jet Pens. It's Jam Studio. I don't know if you can see that with the glare. If I can link it, I will. Um, and that's my, that's a journal card for me. And that is a Coffee Monster Co. journal card. Um, there, Drago. So in here, I have stickers that I wouldn't put in here because I use, like, I could put paydays in there. I think I'm still racking that out in my brain. Um, a mini sheet that I use, I use three of these a week or two of these a week. I use, this takes me a month and it's gone. Why am I going to? Peel 28, is that right? Seven times four. 28 stickers twice in a month. That doesn't make sense. So that's where this makes sense to me. Um, That's a new sticker in my shop. And I'm like, I want one. So that's just a reason. That, those could be totally put in there. Um, The remember stickers could be put in there. In fact, I have small ones in there. So some of these, it's... It's I just haven't fully decided. And I have some migraine in here. But I also was like, I don't need to put the whole sheet in here. And I'm only doing that with my... I'm only getting weird like that with my stickers. So I don't know where that's coming from. And then here I have a few that I haven't put in here yet. Um, I tend to use the Miss Moss reading one a lot. So I was like, I don't know if I need to put her in there. Again, haircut stickers could totally go in there. COVID cooties could go in there. So some of these can probably find their way in there. Um, I have three, look at this, you guys laugh, look at this. That's a holiday sheet. I have three of these sheets, and look at how one of them, I didn't use President's Day here. And I put Easter in somewhere, but I haven't put it in somewhere else. And I have it here from leftovers, so I'm trying to use my holiday stickers that I'm apparently terrible at using. And I also need to do a new sheet, I need to update that, anyway. Currently watching, I have been using a lot of those. So again, I didn't feel like it was necessary. And then, so halfway through, you get one, two, three, four, five. Five times four, 20 slots. And you saw I have a couple that are doubled. And then the other five have two, so 10 slots that are just big and easy to just shove stickers in which I actually didn't realize. So I'm going to have to, it looks like there's a crease, but there's not. Um, I'm going to do something. Actually, I wonder, I wonder, hold on a second. Let's test this. Does this sheet fit? Oh, it's tight, but it fits. Okay. That's a Hobonichi sheet in my shop. I don't know other shop sizes. I have some. Anyway, I'm going to actually try that out. So, I was using these at work, um, and I started using these in November, so I still have part of November. I have some months here that I was using in my Hobonichi. Again, now we have a zipper pocket. So these are great to put in, like, those weekly stickers you use that you don't have. It doesn't make sense to put in a sticker binder, unless it does for you. I shouldn't say that. Like, I'm not right. Um, okay. Okay. So that's this. It's cute. I don't always slip this on. In fact, I kind of think I want to remove it because of the way I carry this. Yeah. <laughs> oh, God, guys. That's what happens. Yeah, I think I want to remove it. Gone. Okay. So those are those two. The two other items in this are these guys. And um, this one holds all my 
full sheet stickers that I have. Um, most of these that I use from my calendars are miscuts. We tend to, oh, wow. that, oh, that's not how that ended up. Interesting. That was a, that was a t t trial and error. Anyway, um, these ones are, uh, they don't peel well. We tend to test new blades, um, with those stickers because it's, it's, the least amount of cuts, it's easy to peel all the things. And then these are just random journaling cards. I don't know. These are my tab stickers. So again, those don't make sense to put in here either. But I don't, I don't really know. I guess I need to figure that out. These are oops stickers that I don't probably need. Okay, so these are my my five by seven sheets basically because they don't they don't fit in here. They just I could probably slice off my header and put them in here and maybe at some point I'm organized enough to do that because I'm using this and I tend to have to look for this so this I'm gonna come back to that again then there's this this right now holds all my little I'm gonna move the samplers um and I'm slowly weeding through these and using them and going through and seeing what I need and what I don't need and all the things but right now that's in there um, and then it has just some random sheets. Random, really, these ones are really random. I've had these edit stickers forever. Um, but this, I feel like, is that good little pack that can just come with me. So I kind of want to get this to have a little bit of this in the stickers that I, like, I need a sheet of, um, I don't have it handy. I need a sheet of Dragos in here. Um, I probably need some mix of, of stickers in here. But that's kind of where I'm getting to because I was doing it with my little one. And then that little holder just, it was wrecking stickers. All of this is where I'm at. Um, I will tell you that I think sticker organization is in, is probably the most personal thing we all do because everybody does it differently. I know a lot of people, a lot of people who file their stickers by theme. All my baking stickers go together. It's just, it's a random one. All my, all my bill pay stickers go together. It makes a lot of sense. I just don't file that way. <laughs> um, maybe one day I'll change. I don't know. So the other thing is, is I mentioned this bag in my last video. So this bag holds, I keep these two folders in here. I should add, hold on. I have my, my washi cutter, my whiteout, and my tweezers. So my, this is like my little planner kit. These two go in here and they fit. I don't know if it'll zip with this one. I don't think it zips with that one, but it's fine. And then I can put this one in here, but I typically keep this in a drawer over there by the side of my desk because I use it. I pull it out all the time. And I typically only pull this out weekly. Same with this, even though this could probably, let me see if it fits. I don't think I've ever put it in here. It, it could probably stay in there because this is mostly the weekly ones. But for now, I'm gonna put it back in my drawer. So I keep these in my drawer. I have taken this to work with me. I don't typically use my personal planner when I'm at work a lot. So I don't know that I would need that. And my work planner is very simple and it has its stickers in it. So I don't know, but I just wanted that. This is my main thing. Let's update. Let's talk about it. That's my sticker organization. I will link this. I will link the files. Um, and this one in, in the, in the, uh, in the links. And, um, if you had any questions, if you saw me flipping through, you saw a sticker, like shout out where it was. I mean, like a timestamp and I'll, I'll see if I can help you out. Other than that, guys, um, take care, be kind, and I'll see you next time.